everyone welcome to this video so today i'm here with a mystery box uh, this is kind of a stationary themed mystery box um, and i purchased this from etsy from a seller called i spy kawaii supplies i think um, i'll put that on screen i'll link the etsy down below um, but yeah really excited for this one they have a lot of really cutesy style stuff by the looks of it and you can pick your theme so i think you like you could just pick anything cute i think you could pick dogs or cats or bunnies stuff like that um, and i said i'd love anything cutesy but maybe not dogs or cats unless they're characters i said i love rabbits hamsters that sort of stuff um so yeah it's all arrived well admittedly it arrived a while ago so i'm just doing the video now and I thought the packaging was really cute because they had these really cute little stickers on um, and then I've just opened uh, it up here to take a thumbnail we've got little um, Molang washi tape there which looks absolutely adorable and then there was also this little extra sticker sheet put in on top which I thought was super adorable I love those little bunnies that is so cute um, so yeah I've just opened it up like I said took a thumbnail we've got another little bunny so it might be quite rabbit themed which I love rabbits are so cute I can't remember exactly how much this was again i'll put that on screen I, but i think it was around 15 pounds that might have been included in shipping but i could be wrong um but i'll put that all on screen um but yeah that was just what i paid at the time obviously that could change and stuff like that so i've just torn it open a bit this is what i can see inside it looks super adorable um so let's go for the first item then so already we've got hamsters yay that's so cute very sweet that they thought to send me hamsters I am not sure what these are. I don't know if it's stickers or like little cards. I think they look like little cards possibly. There's hamsters on top and there's little bunnies. Yeah, I think they're like little note cards. That one could be really cute. I could use that um, to write thank you notes for my own like small business stuff. That's really adorable. And then we have a pen here. And this is Sumiko Garashi, which I love. Um, so this looks like maybe like a little highlighter pen. I'm not fully sure, but there's like a little pink nib and then also like a clear looking nib. I don't know if it's erasable ink or, or for blending. I'm honestly not sure, but that is a really nice looking pen. I'm sure I will be able to figure out what it is. <laughs> And then next up we have this and this is adorable so this looks like it could be like a little pad of like sticky notes maybe um and this is really cute it's like a massive squirrel i love how rodenty themed this is so far and there's like a little nut and then some washi tape and this is molang i love that and we've got some themed characters in here as well that is amazing so this tape looks super cute as Molang and like ice cream. I'll do a close up of this stuff afterwards actually. I'll lay it out on the table and then flip the camera at the end. And then next up we have this. Um, it says I love fruit. There's a bunch of little animals on it. I'm assuming it's another pen of some kind or another. So I might not open that just yet because it's all sealed and I just want to leave it like that for now. Um, but yeah, I'm assuming it's probably a pen or something, but that packaging is so adorable. And then we've got this here. This is so cute. It's a bit sticky notes and it's like a cute little blob. I love the little eyes. I love that it's pink as well. And then we have a little uh, pencil, a little mechanical pencil. And this is cute. They're like two little bugs in a blanket on there. It's got a really nice grip to it as well, which is awesome. Um, yeah, I love that. That's so nice. And there's a little postcard. This is super adorable. So we've got little bunnies. And this is going to be really handy. I'll have to use this for one of my uh, friends, possibly even to send to my nan or something like that. Oh, I nearly missed these little things in the corner. I love this. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. It's a little clip and it's like a little hamster or mouse or something coming out of a donut. I love that. It's so adorable. It's a really nice acrylic material. I wonder what I could use that for. Maybe like for some receipts or just some paperwork. That is so cute. And then hidden away in the other corner <laughs> was this little eraser, a little bunny eraser. That super cute little square one. I love how it looks like the bunny goes all the way through. That's kind of weird. That's really cool. And then the last item is this sticker sheet. Um, and this has got hamsters on it. And that's so cute. There's like a hamster and a bird. That's a kind of weird combination. There's little squirrels and hamsters in shoes, a little hedgehog, all sorts on here. Those are really cute. I love that it's they're kind of like on, in a little bookcase. So here's a close up of all of the items. Hopefully you guys can see them a little bit better. 
So I'm just going to do a little once over. So much cute stuff. I haven't opened that yet, but I'm assuming it's just a pen. Um, but probably with this really cute designer with the fruit and stuff like that. So adorable. Here was the Molang tape with the little ice creams on it. And the stickers. Really, really adorable. Um, and one thing I would say that I think would have been great is I think the seller should have like a little business card or some just details about their shop or some information. That could have been really cool. Um, but yeah, I love everything. It's so cute. So that was everything and it's really all so adorable. I love it. I really appreciate the fact that they listen to like, you know, that I kind of mainly wanted like hamsters and rodent-y style things and bunnies and stuff like that. Everything is so cute. There's a nice variety of different types of pens, uh, pencil, eraser, um, even like this stuff like these little note cards and the um, postcard was really cool as well some little stickers sticky notes washi tape so really nice variety loads of different items um and i'd say it is worth the money you know stationery is expensive especially when you've got like really cute stationery and stuff from like japan and stuff like that it is expensive you know you could literally go into a shop and you know you'd see some sticky notes for at least like two three quid sometimes so i think i've got a total of about 12 items here so i think if it was about 15 pound i think that is good value for money because you know it's a little bit over a pound an item but like i said in shops they would retail for much more and it's nice the way obviously it's all been put together the seller's got to make profit as well at the end of the day um, and that includes shipping you know there's a lot of stuff to consider and I, yeah, I think it's all really adorable. So I'm really happy with this. Um, so let me know what you guys think of it and maybe what your favorite item was. I think my favorite item is actually this. Like it's so small and random, but I haven't really got anything like this. And I just think that's so cute, the little mouse. Um, and I just want to find something I can use that for. Um, yeah, maybe just like some receipts. You Sometimes I keep receipts for a while or something like that. Um, but yeah, it's absolutely adorable. I really love that. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and thank you to the seller as well. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video and I'll see you next time. Bye!